Hey guys, so a little bit of technical update for um, StarConnect users on Argent X uh, wallet and st extension. So if you are trying to do a transaction in your Argent X wallet and it's not going through, you're seeing this particular error transaction failure, uh, failure predicted, you're seeing this particular error here. And you can see that the confirm button is green, which means you cannot move out any asset if eventually you have a main net asset here. You can't move it out unless you fix this. Your, mon your funds will be gone unless you uh, try to recover using this other way that I'm about to show you. There's a way to recover the funds using the CLI tool from Argent X. And this article here, I'm going to leave a link to this article in the description of this video. It explains clearly in steps how you're going to recover your funds using the CLI tool. It's slightly technical, but it's easy as well to do if you can simply stay patient and follow instructions so um what happened was part uh, particularly for me i bridged for um, ethereum mainnet ethereum to um uh, to StarkNet on this particular depreciated wallet. What happened here is that this wallet is depreciated. If you're finding this area, it means that your wallet is depreciated. This particular agent S wallet is depreciated. I cannot be upgraded anymore. So you'd have to create a new wallet. So before you even try to use the CLI tool to recover your assets, you need to create a new agent X wallet. And probably you can use a different browser to download the extension. If you're using Chrome on this one, you could use Brave or a Carbon Browser or any other browser um, to download the um, the, the uh, Argent X extension and create a new wallet so you can do this seamlessly. So what you have to do is to follow these instructions step by step. You have to download the latest version of the CLI tool by going to this particular link. You will find this link inside this article here as well. So all you have to do if you're using, you can select the appropriate um, tool for your operating system. There's for Linux, there's for Mac, and there's for um, Windows as well. So you can see for Windows, the ones for Mac here, you can see the ones for Linux here. If you download the one that is appropriate to you and run it on your PC. So let's just assume that I haven't done this. I'm just gonna show you real quick what it looks like here. So you just simply have to open the tool, run the tool right here. Um, <coughs> it's gonna actually just choose a network. So if you're trying to transfer your funds out of mainnet or testnet, you can toggle using the arrow key. Um, click on enter and then if you want to recover by seed or private key it's going to ask you if you want to recover by seed just go ahead and click on enter most people actually use the seed phrase anyway so you have to enter your seed phrase now i'm going to quickly do this considering that this wallet is depreciated and i don't use it anymore so i'm going to try to quickly reveal the seed phrase of this particular one right here just uh, real quick Mm, let's see what it looks like here. So, uh, I'm just gonna copy this right here. The wallet is useless anyway, so just uh, it doesn't matter. So you simply uh, paste it and click on enter. It's gonna discover the account, and once it discovers the account, it's gonna show all the wallets that are related to that account. And but if it shows zero wallets for zero um, account for any reason, all you have to do is to copy the address of the wallet you want to transfer from copy the particular address of the agent x wallet you want to transfer from in my case it's this particular one so i'll just have to copy it and see if this is done discovering it's not done discovering but before then we could just go back to this article and see the particular steps here so once you are right there Look at the discovering accounts right here. It's going to tell you how many wallets it is found. If it's found zero wallets, you can enter the wallet address manually and um, just go ahead and press enter. And when you see, you will see your agent X wallet balance. You select the one you want to use and press enter to transfer all the tokens to a new address. Now, because I've already done this, it's probably not going to show me again. So it's just going to tell me to enter my the wallet address I want to use. I'm going to enter this one and press enter. Now. If I had not done this already, it's going to show me the balance. He actually did previously when I did it for the first time. It shows you the balance on this particular wallet, and you would have to simply click on it, and it's going to bring, it's going to simply bring up another uh, page where you would have to go ahead and copy the new one. Go to your previous browser, and you know, copy the new Argent X. Uh, if you're using a different browser like Brave, go there, open your uh, Argent X extension copy the wallet address of your new um, Argent X wallet and paste it right there. Once you click on, on the next here, once you click on this um, on this address that contains the funds you want to move out, uh, paste the address there, 
to transfer and click on enter to transfer your funds just give it a few minutes it's going to transfer your funds successfully it's not really that technical it's not really that complex it's something that anyone can do so i hope you found some value in this just don't let your funds get lost or get confused if eventually you have breached funds or sent uh, uh, mainnet uh, ethereum from uh, mainnet starknet uh, starknet mainnet ethereum to your address and you see notice that you can't move it anymore guys if you learned something from this video hit like hit that subscribe button and turn on the notification bell keep your eyes on for when we post any relevant content on this channel guys cheers and see you in the next topics bye